Hello, I'm Sai, a doctoral candidate at Adva and the chair of Communication Networks. I would like to introduce you to Optical Network Planning. Imagine you have to send a package from Hamburg to Munich via the autobahn. Like you, there are many others who want to send their packages. Some of these are very small and others are super large. If you hire a logistics company, they would ensure your package reaches Munich subject to the traffic on the road, the size of the vehicle and the urgency of your need. The logistics company selects a vehicle which fits all the packages, has a good speed and then selects a travel route which has the least amount of traffic. They need to do all of this while still trying to be profitable. Optical networking works similarly. Where network operators are the logistics company, the roads are optical fibers, vehicles are channels, and you are an internet service like Netflix or Spotify. Modern optical networks allow us greater control on the optical channels which carry information. Using a flexible grid, channels can carry different data rates on the same optical fiber. The challenge then is not only to maintain strict quality of transmission requirements but also to reduce the cost of deploying such technology intensive infrastructure. This enables operators to recover investments as quickly as possible. In the coming years, 5G deployment will lead to a big jump in optical network traffic. Adding to that, socio-economic conditions like COVID-19 pandemic has increased our daily dependence on high-quality streaming and video conferencing services. Network operators need to therefore plan their network more efficiently and use software-based reconfiguration in order to add new services. They may also need to use additional optical bands in order to fit future demands. As a first step, we developed a novel heuristic which selects the best channel setting of a light path in the network based on the quality of service requirements of the network. With this heuristic, we achieve a 40% gain in network throughput as compared to the state of art. We also see that most light paths can carry more than 200 gigabits per second if flexible grid is used. These results were presented in Optical Fibers Conference 2020. As a part of Opticon, a research project funded by the German government, we develop algorithms, find innovations and research new methods in network planning. If you are interested to learn more or work with us, drop a mail to the following email ID or visit our page given in the link below. Thank you for listening.